Okay, so finally, what happens if we want a loop and have a conditional? So this is actually really, really simple to do. So we've got our, we'll stick with our map here. Okay, we've got C equals, and then we've got a map of key value pairs. Okay. Um, what happens if we want to, run task has to be true, otherwise we don't want to loop over the, uh, over the map. Well, we just literally say, if run task equals equals true. Okay, you can combine these two elements. So a task can have multiple task level parameters on there. In this case, we want to add loop and when. Okay, there's nothing stopping you from doing that. This when statement can even have the one that we had earlier, run task equals equals true, where we use the where we use a um, a list of statements which are go into an and statement for us. Ansible will build up an and statement, so everything has to be true. Say goodbye equals equals false. So both of those things are true, so that when we execute, we'll get the same values on the screen that we have right there, which is from the last run, because both of those statements are true. And there you have it. We execute with our, our name, our age, and our gender. And that is how you add a condition to a to a task whilst also looping as well the condition will have to be true each and every time otherwise it won't execute simple